Well, hello to you today, and let's go ahead and get started. Timid, coward, weakness, doormat. These are some of the words that are used for a word that we find in the Bible, and it is one of the most misunderstood words in all of Holy Scripture. It is the word meekness. Jesus said, blessed are the meek in Matthew 5, 5. And Numbers 12, 3 says that Moses was the meekest man on the face of the earth. Well, I assure you, Moses was not a, me a weak man. He had a fierce temper, and that temper got him in trouble early in life, and then that tr that temper got him in trouble at the end of his life and prohibited him from taking the people, leading the people in to the promised land. Meekness has been equated with weakness for a number of years and a number of miles. But what is meekness? Well, in a sentence, it is strength, believe it or not, that is manageable. It is strong enough to be gentle if you will. Let me give you a picture that helps me. You've got this black stallion who reigns across the plains, if you will. Uh, he is the head of his herd. He has no equal. He has no opponent. He has no challenger. He is confident. He can run as fast as the wind, and his strength knows no limits. You can take that stallion. You can train it. It will submit to you. You can train it to the commands to turn left, to turn right, to stop. But has that stallion lost any of its speed and or strength? And the answer is no. Weakness, no. Meekness, strength, yes. Strength under control, strength that can be used.